feel like the group has grown and expanded and improved in such a way that leading towards the choir games, we, weren't, we, weren't, we didn't think that we were ready. Um, vocally, we didn't think we were ready in terms of getting our preparations there, but then we did it because we believed in ourselves, we believed in each other, and we've built such a strong connection within the choir that now we know where our our weaknesses are and our and where we're strong together. And it's been such an amazing experience to go with these people because we're all sort of going through the same stuff and you're all experiencing it the same way. Two weeks before our, uh, our World Choir Games, we were 18 singers, we had lost five uh, people who couldn't go to the World Choir Games. One of our pieces splits into 13 parts, so we had to make plans. And so we were obviously going with a plan, we want to do our best, we believe our best is at a gold standard, um, not at all disappointed with the silver, in fact that's what we deserve, um, because it gives us the space to grow, it gives us a space to develop, it gives us a space for people now to be like, okay, they've done a the silver, we got to do better. I think that in the Quantu Choir, we really can see some hope for collaboration. We can see a cross-section, although it has a lot of students, it also has non-students. It has some professionals, it has some aspiring professionals, it has people who are looking for work, it has young people, it has people across the spectrum. And in that sense, Kepa has, uh, has achieved a great thing and a first thing for Grahamstown. So when you ask what does it mean? The difficulty with, with doing a project such as this was that it, it needs a lot of energy, which is what, what I mentioned in the concert today, is that more than anything, what has pushed us and what has made us do what we do has been the energy that we felt from people who are big and from people who are small. called this thing deliberately a community choir and that's where our heart, that's where our dreams, that's where our miracles come out of. They come out of a community. So although the path has been difficult, um, it requires a huge amount of energy. Um, it's been very rewarding in that at the end of the day it brings people together. And we're only just looking particularly for the choristers and the audiences that one moment where an audience gets touched by the sound, by the harmony, by the truthfulness and by the essence of the music that we make.